So here is day three, and I guess I'm going to go teleport to the only friend I have online, which is actually a friend called Kurika. Um, I didn't learn her name until a bit later. A Japanese player who um, actually was one of the first, I think the first person I recorded anyway, who uh, took me by the hand and led me places. Um, so here she is. I don't think she ever changed her look. I think she looked like that the entire game. The entire beta. Uh, sadly, I do not know her in live, but this is Kareka. And, and this isn't somebody giving a heart. We didn't have heart gifts at the time. This is simply every single time you gave candles. A candle to open a friendship. Um... You got a heart, or, or, or they, they got, you gave a heart. Basically, you gave a heart with a candle. So I'm just standing here. I have no idea how to take hand, or how to join a group unless they offer the hand. Um, I didn't learn that until people told me later. So I had no clue how to do that. I could only offer my hand, but I knew I didn't want to do that because I didn't want to lead. I'd already tried that, you know, just like everybody. I, you know, newbie, make a friend, offer a hand, and then lead. It's like, oh, I don't want to lead. Uh, so I knew not to do that part, but I didn't know how to actually take a hand. Um, like myself, without it being offered. So we're actually going to go through four, the entire forest this time. Um, and break it up into two parts, because it's kind of long. So I guess this is the first time I noticed this tunnel, because uh, it's actually lit. Somebody must have been in there to light the candles already. Uh, so there's these. And there would be Sleeping Toby. And there is a story to that. Uh, Toby used to just sit there and sleep, and I think they probably knew him. I did not know him. And of course, I didn't notice him at all. But I was sleeping Toby there, laying down in that hallway. This was his place. This cave was his place. Uh, of course, I didn't know him yet then. I just, none of that. Uh, but this is the, and the, the again, it's kind of glitchy. Early days. Just looking around, sleeping Toby. Hello, Toby. Only I don't know you yet. And this is this emote. Okay, or not. And she offers her hand, but I apparently didn't take it for some reason. So she's just going to walk on without me. Again, I, I, I probably was half not paying attention. Um, there she goes. Let's try again. Now I take it. There we go. Figure it out, Tara. Newbie Tara. And so this is going to be my first, um, I believe... First time uh, being with a group. And I can see I'm seeing chat, and I don't understand how you chat. And I knew nothing about it. And there's no, again, no guides, no prompts, no nothing to tell you. And there's no chat button on the screen. Um, the only way you could chat, I'm pretty sure the only way you could go to chat at the time was to actually hit the chat button in the friend menu. And then that would open chat. And so if you didn't have chat with anybody, you couldn't open chat and chat. There was no way to do it. So for me, I'm just sitting there going, like, how do you chat? The only thing I could come up with, with typing was the, the friend thing. So I was very, very confused. It was extremely off-putting for me, um, which is why on the wiki and places, I'll always say, you know, be assured, people chatting and you can't see their chat they're not talking about you most likely they're not talking about you and if they are talking about you it's more of i really feel bad this person can't see our chat um, so 
because for me it was a uh, I have very very low self-esteem so for me I just always assumed people were talking about me and making fun of me just from my childhood so it's like that that leaves an impression and you kind of take that into everywhere and look we're gonna go find a new emote uh, actually go off to the left a little bit this used to house an emote now it has that cave where we had a seasonal spirit but this used to house an emote the this guy in the current game has moved on down the down the way a little bit but see there's actually a boat here that you can actually kind of see him maybe trying to move or something yeah very unpolished, unpolished emotes, spirits. But it's, it's funny to see how just how little guidance the game gave back and all of that was in development. You were really, really left to friends in game because there was no guides, there was no YouTubers, there was no wiki, there was nothing. This little structure kept moving. It would it would keep getting moved when they redid the redid the um, level a little bit. This would get moved off, and look funny, be floating. <laughs> this kept getting relocated a little bit. It's funny to see no stars. There's no sky child over there. There's, there's no winged light over there. Um, and this was the shy emote. Again, I never went left and right. I stayed straight. Yeah, good memory, shy emote. And she moved up the way a little bit. Again, these didn't have any cosmetics to give. All the cosmetics were found at the little kiosks, little platforms you found in the world. I think I'm holding on to her for dear life now at this point. It's like, I need help. Now, it's funny because my memory of this trip here, and maybe, maybe it does happen later, was of an absolute speed run, but it's once we found a pink cape. I am pretty sure that red cape right there is Troggy. Pretty sure, but I didn't friend her this day. Old, old uh, journey friend. And poof, everyone vanished. Now, I thought they left me intentionally. I thought they were chatting and left me intentionally. Now I look at that again going, oh, it was a server, it was a server disconnect. Obviously, I server, I server, server merged. I, I split server because suddenly they're back. So, but I swear, oh my God, I just made me feel horrible that they just vanished on me like that. And I didn't know. Uh, anyway, here they are again. I am pretty sure that's Troggy. Pretty sure that is her look. I'm like, ah, keep up. Um, these were lights and these candles, and I didn't see it, I don't think, led you to the, um, the deep bow emote that was over to the left. This is actually the same. The emote, the deep bow is still over to the left, even though the whole thing looks different. Um, but I don't, I didn't get these, this candle, these hovering floating candles were really weird. They were not a clear thing for me, I don't think. Here's who I think is Troggy coming back for me. But we didn't friend here. I friended Troggy later. And her, her um, this, I think maybe the same day or maybe the next day, so as it turned out. I didn't know any of these people who they actually were for months. Um, but anyway. I ran into three people I knew here, uh, or two people I knew um, prior to this here, and I didn't know it for months.
Now we're going to see some emotes that I don't have. And my first experience with um, getting to do some emotes that I don't yet own. Uh, learning that you can, when you're attached to somebody else, they'll, you'll do the emote they have, that they do. Okay, so anyway, I have no idea who these other two are. I don't think I ever... Uh, and they may not have seen those candles because they already had the emote. What I realize now is a lot of these people were, because eating was still fairly new, um, they were doing Eden runs and racing through. There was no such thing as a as a reset and all that stuff. You could just keep doing Eden and go re recollect, do Eden, recollect. didn't matter. And, of course, it was emotes back then. That's how you got your upgrades was by going to Eden and basically saving them, resetting. But um, the version of Eden that was live here was very, 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 very difficult. Um, and a lot of people had struggled a lot with it and died in it. And the point was not to die at the time. It was to survive. You were finding all of the, all of the, the candle run, basically. Uh, mostly candles here. Um, we had some of the dark, dark stone, as they call it here, um, but a lot of candles. And so I will continue this in part two. So thanks for watching.